and welcome back to what we pray is the final stretch of the 2004 National Spelling Bee. For the past two and a half hours, we've been down to these three remaining spellers. Pamela, Sean, and Dot. Congratulations, guys. Uh, who's ready to give up? Huh? Not me, no way. My huh? grandmother says that winners never quit and quitters never win. My granny says that when I get boobs, I can keep my money right here. <laughs> all the oh, oh, there's the bell. Sean O'Brien is our first speller this round. <laughs> Your word is incisor. Incisor. Wow, I'm already I... bored. Uh, you know what? Earlier, I asked Sean what he would do with the $12,000 prize money. Let's go to that clip, huh? If I win, I'm gonna send the money to our family in Korea. I wish the prize was a million dollars. I wish the prize was a monkey that would steal a wallet. Incorrect. Oh, it's okay, you want my gum? And Sean was just eliminated. I guess we really shouldn't be cutting away while the kids are spelling. <laughs> Sorry, but as long as we did, hey, here's some other footage of kids getting eliminated, huh? Euphony. <laughs> Billowus. <laughs> Colloquialism. <laughs> Chrysanthemum. <laughs> Fulminate. It's funny to us adults because we know it's really not that important. <laughs> oh, and uh, ne next up is eight-year-old Dot Goddard. <clears throat> Your word is vexillary. What's the definition? A standard bearer. Oh, can I have the origin? It's Latin. <laughs> can you do the splits? <laughs> What's wrong with your ears? I suffer from a disease called red ear. And this is the last time I'm telling you that. Does it hurt? Yes, it burns. Can I get it? If you come over here and lick my ears. Can I go over there and lick your ear? Miss Goddard? Please spell vexillary or be disqualified. Hmm. Huh? I'm thinking. <laughs> vexillary. V e x i l l a r y. Vexillary. Correct. Wow. Uh, I asked Dot's father how he felt about his daughter being in the spelling bee earlier. Here's what he had to say. Well, at first I was suspicious. I thought it was some kind of cruel joke. Then when I found out that it was true, that in fact my daughter had made it all the way to the National Spelling Bee, well, I just felt inconvenienced like it was gonna eat up my whole weekend. From the back, sometimes people think my dad looks like a lady. Remember that time when that man whistled at you and said, sexy mama? Yes, I do. <laughs> How come your hair grows in here and not here? We really should not have cut away just then. Dot Goddard has done the unthinkable and won the National Spelling Bee. Dot, Dot how do you feel? Where's the bee? Bee? No, there's no Where's bee. Where's the bee? That bee is going to come and fly down, and I'm going to get on its back and fly away. No, you, you don't win a bee in this competition, Dot. But I learned, I learned all those words. That's why I learned those words, so that big bee would come and sting me, and then I'd eat it. <laughs> Adorable. Where's that B? No, no B, but but you do get cash money. There's oh, no good. B. Good. There's, there's money. We'll take the money. But there's no there's no B. No. This this is B U L L. The 2004 National Spelling Bee will no longer be seen. ESPN now joins Extreme Hungry Hungry Hippos already in progress. <laughs>